Hey YouTube, this is Alexander again. Today I, I'm trying to understand how this Waco Perfect Power PP500 uh, is working and uh, mostly why it doesn't work anymore. So um, this device gives 500 watts uh, output with a uh, square wave, not a real scene wave. But uh, anyway, you can use this device on your car for to use the, your 12 volt batteries for to feed any uh, uh, power consumption uh, devices uh, which need uh, the main uh, where where you are in your car or anything like that. So um, I take apart this uh, devices and you will hear you you will have uh, it here. And so. What you can see here, this is uh, the input here, which we which have a very big cable because uh, this kind of device uses lots of current. Here you see the fuse, which are huge too, because this kind of device use uh, use lots of current for to provide 500 watts output, which are uh, 500 RMS in this case. So you will have the, the DC input coming from here to this capacitor which uh, provides uh, a good continue continue uh, value to this uh, MOSFET you can see here there are four and they work like a switching power supply can do for to uh, give a square signals to this coil after this uh, you have uh, um, you work over a uh, square wave, the same square wave like the entry, but to the output with the height uh, voltage, and uh, the, this height voltage frequency is rectified by this uh, height speed diodes, which can you, which you can see here, and uh, this voltage is filtered by this capacitor. You can see a missing capacitor here because I uh, for to make uh, some investigation. I dismounted one of them uh, for to uh, try it to, uh, to, to for to see if this capacitor presents any sign of uh, damage but this is not the case for to begin my investigation I just tried to measure uh, with the, the ohm impedance uh, something to found we when the device is not connected to anything if there is a short with uh, between the leads of this capacitor and uh, of course I found a little short of uh, 50, 50 ohms which means there is something consuming lots of current in the final stage which was uh, compound with these four uh, transistors so my first thought was about this uh, diodes which are here for to protect uh, to give more protection to the gate of this uh, transistor maybe this is for this but, but it can be a protective diode for to protect uh, just the gate about uh, some any any other other parasites or something like that but um, I'm not really interested and uh, interested by why the, this kind of diodes are here but the 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 main thing when you when I was uh, searching the faulty transistor here for to understand one why there is a high impedance um, low impedance between this capa uh, leads capacitor, I was confused because you don't know if there is a faulty diodes connected to the leads of the transistor. So I dismount all this compound and try each diode one after one for to understand and uh, try to find a faulty component but so in in fact the issue coming from this uh, devices f comes from the fact that there is there, there is a pair uh, two of them which are completely shorty this transistor are uh, ERF uh, 740 and they are uh, they are a MOSFET transistor kernel uh, uh, N channel I think and uh, of course I try it with this devices 
and try to understand what can tell me this little uh, so you can see here for this faulty component there is a resistor of uh, 27 ohm between 2 and 1 and uh, 26 ohm between 1 and 3 and of course I put a little red mark on this one for to uh, make um, for to uh, disclude this and so if you take the good one because there is two one two good uh, piece and this one don't, don't doesn't work too, too. okay like you can see this one is good like uh, like this one too and the red mark are the bed the bed component here so um, apparently this output stage for to um, to make alternative current is uh, faulty and uh, it's uh, uh, the, 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 it's remain me to understand why this uh, transistors failed so for to try to understand if uh, there is a uh, faulty signals for to command the gate of the, this uh, this uh, transistors you you need to understand and to see if there is a continuous signal on the gates and you need uh, to, um, to to be sure about that before to uh, push as a new component like that for to try to repair these uh, devices okay the device is working, the green LED is ok, so you have not any more a short circuit and uh, the current dropping is not too much because this is uh, uh, solved the problem for the moment uh, about uh, the short circuit. What I'm going to do here is to take my high voltage probe and to, and to look here. about the gate what what signals can be about the gate you absolutely don't want to found a continuous signal on this gate you can see here the the, the signal driving the, the the stage level the output stage level for to uh, recreate the alternative current with this uh, kind of ponder western but only for to recreate an alternative current so this is the third output and the fourth output here and you can see uh, this uh, undulation is this wave comes from the fact that then I use only my uh, my chip here and I d don't use this one because uh, for to say for, for to be honest in this case at this uh, output there is no real ground and um, this is, was, this is uh, what we call in French uh, uh, mass flottant and so um, I you can just find the signal without because of this kind of uh, scope are very sensitive you can just use your chip here for to detect any uh, signal without connecting the, the ground anywhere okay so in fact uh, the the output signal here for to recreate the output sig square signal uh, seems to be okay so uh, for to understand this device is you're just you just need to understand then the dc component voltage from your battery go through this fuse which are huge in this case because this kind of device needs lots of lots of current they are filtered um, quickly for to uh, decrease the um, the impedance of the line with this little capacitor and uh, you can see one of them here is a little uh, faulty and bulky i think you need to change this one because uh, he's uh, he's 
he have uh, he have a very bad appearance so this is not the priority for for the moment but so the dc current go through this um, component and go to this MOSFET which uh, and the, uh, the the voltage and the current are sent to this coil with a switching effect because this is a switching uh, power supply like uh, uh, amplifier can can work this is exactly the same case for the uh, power amplifier for your car and so you recovered the signals at the output of this uh, coil and this output is rectified and filtered by this uh, diodes here and this capacitor and uh, so the uh, the continuous signals coming from this uh, coil and this filtering go through this uh, pond it's uh, made like uh, pond whiston uh, with this uh, uh, a MOSFET transistor and uh, you have a dedicated uh, integrated circuit which uh, recreate a square signals for to uh, to feed the output you can hear so for to um, to to try to make in some investigation you have to you need to understand um, how this kind of device work so it remains to me to ask the owner if uh, he wants to to, to to uh, to purchase a new component like those one i think they are very not expensive but i'm not pretty sure that it will be enough about that so this is the reason why i uh, check the output of this um, this uh, circuit uh, integrated circuit for to drive this uh, mosfet because maybe you just have to change your transistor but uh, you can have to change your ic driver too which is uh, very important in this case because it's recreate the main from uh, 320 volts dc continue current going coming from this uh, coil and this uh, filter so uh, this is uh, 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 to be continued uh, uh, a video I think I just uh, have to see the owner about uh, this uh, issue because uh, he he wants to, to see uh, he wants to know why this uh, device doesn't work anymore so uh, this is all for evening I think uh, um, I need to uh, to see for the moment and uh, tell you see you soon